Xylem, nature, xylem, Greek xylos, wood, is a vascular and mechanical tissue. In other words, it is a conducting tissue. Xylem is composed of cells called elements of four different types. Tracheids, vessels or trache, xylem, parenchyma, and xylem, sclerenchyma, or fiber. Except xylem parenchyma, all other xylem elements are dead and bounded by thick lignified walls. Of these four types of cells of xylem, most important cells are vessels. Vessels are shorter and wider than tracheids. Vessels are very long, tube-like structures formed by a row of cells placed end to end. The transverse walls between the vessel elements are partially or completely dissolved to form continuous channels or water pipes. Tracheids are elongated cells with tapering ends. They also conduct water. Since tracheids do not have open ends like the vessels, so that water has to pass from cell to cell via the pits. Xylem parenchyma stores food and helps in lateral conduction of water. Functions The main function of xylem is to carry water and mineral salts upward from the root to different parts of shoots. Since walls of tracheids, vessels and sclerenchyma of xylem are lignified, they give mechanical strength to the plant body. Flume Nature, like xylem, flume, Greek flus, bark, contains tubes but performs no mechanical function. Flume is composed of following four elements or cells. Sieve tubes, companion cells, flume parenchyma and flume fibers. Except for flume fibers, Phloem cells are living cells. Sieve tubes. Sieve tubes are slender, tube-like structures composed of elongated, thin-walled cells placed end to end. Their end walls are perforated by numerous pores and are called sieve plates. Walls of sieve tubes are perforated. The nucleus of each sieve cell degenerates at maturity. However, Cytoplasm persists in the mature cell. Thus, nuclei are absent in mature sieve tube elements. The cytoplasm of one sieve tube element is continuous with those of other sieve elements above and below due to cytoplasmic connections passing through the pores of the sieve plate. Companion cells generally associated with the sieve tube. Small Thin-walled cell containing dense and very active cytoplasm and large elongated nucleus. It is called a companion cell and it is connected to the sieve tube with numerous plasmodesmata. Plume parenchyma. These are thin-walled living cells of parenchyma or plume. They have two functions, storage and slow lateral conduction of food. Plume fibers or bast fibers. These are thick walled, elongated, spindle shaped dead cells which possess narrow lumen. They provide mechanical strength to the tissue. Bast fibers obtained from some plants, such as jute, hemp, flax, has commercial or economic value. Functions Plume transports, conducts photosynthetically prepared food materials from the leaves to the storage organs and later from storage organs to the growing regions of the plant body.